What's up gamers? Today we're playing Five Nights at Freddy's. Uh, treasure Room has ghost bombs. This is the daily run. Yes, I already walked in this room. It was pre-explored. I, I messed up the intro. Don't even, what, moving on. Uh, I saw the daily run was to Mega Satan. It's Kane, my boy. All good pills, such as Pretty Fly, one of the greatest ones. Uh, in this curse room, nothing too special. Don't want to go shop because I'm broke. And I thought, hey, perfect opportunity. Let's get a classic vanilla run in with a bit of cane action and see what kind of gaming we can truly diddly do. Uh, I usually wouldn't do this, but the ghost bombs did give me five bombs. I'm willing to gamble it all. Yes, actually worth it. Swallowed. Fortunately, I forgot that cane starts with a better trinket, but you know, thanks. This is impossible, is it? I don't know. This has to be like god placement level of, of, uh, of bomb. And, and that, that's just what I did. I performed right then and there. Let's go, baby. All right, full on. We got a famine fight. Uh, famine's easy. Blue famine will always drop a soul heart. So that is very exciting. We can take that to the next floor. Probably go devils. Since we already have a key piece, I feel like I don't really need to go angels, do I? Famine is done. We did not lose the eternal heart. We gain a soul heart. And should I look for the secret room? I, I probably will. I mean, it's only one spot. Hold on. If it wasn't here, you would actually be the craziest map I've ever seen. Uh, I'll trade a bomb for a key and I'll just I'll just leave. That's it. Thank you. Ooh, is that worth? Probably not. Uh, actually, it was. This lets me go to the shop. A perfect amount, actually, and I already found the boss. What? All right, I'll go. Got nothing better to do. My devil deal is guaranteed. Unless I somehow skill issue, which I don't know how that would be possible. I feel like Black Dingle was like the easiest dingle. So much that I'm confident to do like orbital strats, which I never do anymore. Go get him, Cuba Meat. Oh my god. I do kind of miss orbital strats, like just walking around like a blue baby with like three different orbitals. It was broken. You know, it needed to not exist 100%, but I kind of miss it. I mean, it's still like you can do it, it's just not nearly as good. Go get him. Nice job, Cuban meat. We get a box. Hello, box. I think you can still get telepills while Lucky Foot is active because telepills counts as a neutral pill. So I'm not going to take that pill just yet. We have the sun card, which is nice. Crack dice is like reeking potential. I might take that with me later. That kind of sucks. <laughs> that kind of really sucks. But hey, I mean, I have a uh, angel room chance now. I didn't just forfeit it. And I actually have better angel chance uh, because I have two key pieces technically already. Uh, some pills here. Open everything first. Magic skin. Oh. Hello. <laughs> okay, I can work with that. Hold on. Uh, let's pop some pills real quick. Full health is good to know. Pretty fly is great as well. We actually have full orbitals now. The ultimate trio. Yeah, we have magic skin. I have no other active items. This could be large. All right, we finally found the treasure room. It's just a vasculatus. Uh, I mean, we don't really need that, but there's nothing else I can do about it. You know, actually, I guess I should just use the magic skin right now, because why not? Boop. Black Lotus. I don't have rolls, but I guess uh, I should check the shop first. You know, maybe there's a dice shard or the crack dice play. I, I shouldn't just take it. I think uh, HP up times three is kind of lackluster. And I honestly think it's one of the worst design things in the game. <laughs> I feel like Black Lotus is actually like severely outdated. Now that I think about it, that thing is old and it's just an ugly design in my opinion. Oh my god, okay, hold on. I uh, I don't care about anything else anymore. <laughs> Black Lotus, you're the best thing to ever happen to me. How about we take the Soul of Cain, check the shop, and then the super secret room, and then we leave. Wow, glitched crown, hello? Oh my goodness, there's a goddamn mystery gift. I suppose this could be pretty large. Ooh, oh, well, I mean, <laughs> it's like kind of large. I don't actually want the Eternal D6. Funnily enough, I feel like magic skin would pay out more if I just held it and then kept using it. But I guess from all of these, I can you get a luck up, a straw man, or a red key use. You know, I don't do this often, and usually I'd go for the red key, but I have a soul of cane, even though I don't even really want to use it on this floor. I I'm gonna go for the double luck up. I think this might be the smart play genuinely. If I had one more cent, I'd totally go again, by the way, but we just don't, so I'll be moving on. Anyway, yeah, I got a little sidetracked, but I feel like Black Lotus is a bit outdated. When did that thing come out again? I believe it was Wrath of the Lamb. And at the time, there were only three heart types, which was, uh, you know, Red Heart, Soul Heart, and Black Heart. 
So what I feel like they were trying to do, at least when I was picking it up when I was a wee lad and uh, playing Flash Isaac, is like, oh my god, it's all the heart containers combined. You know, I mean, it's not really that good, but it's so cool that I don't care. But now it's like, well, there's actually like seven more different heart types. <laughs> so Black Lotus is kind of lackluster in that sense, don't you think? I don't know, maybe in my opinion. I'm just spitballing here, but I would say actually a sleeper pick for uh, an item that should be reworked is Black Lotus. Am I saying that it should give you every single heart type ever once you pick it up? No. Uh, something similar. <laughs> Uh, but not exactly that. No, that would be obviously overpowered. A secret room item giving you like a red heart, black heart, and soul heart, and that's it. It's just, I don't know. It doesn't sit right with me in today's meta of Isaac. If I were like maybe 10 years younger, I'd be like, oh, that's totally, that's such a good item. Uh, no, not in today's standard. Today's standard, we get things like C-section. So having like a weird ass raw liver is, uh, eh, I don't know. Spitball, whatever. Uh, let's move on, get the treasure room. Bot fly. Hold on, double check. Maybe the secret room room has oh god you know you know what i'm talking about right yeah you already know what i'm talking about maybe it has some form of i i can't even speak i got it is that real guys that's not real i got a real map oh my god this is the happiest day of my life but yeah i basically want to use magic skin get a spin down and see if i can spin down that bot fly uh this seems like a completely nuts run 100 percent. like i'm just going ham with it all right just go ahead and give me spin down so i can get death certificate real quick almost i mean you were you were close all right another shop this time we have a reverse card and options these are both really juicy but i don't know if i have the funds available to make that purchase what i would rather do is just like walk around and see if i do eventually get those funds if not, I'll take that reverse card instead because that's pretty juicy as well. Hello, Ace of Diamonds. Uh, or you could just give me all the money in the world. Okay, no, that's that's great actually. I'll, I'll, I'll take this with me. Thank you. All the money. There it is. Thanks. What do you guys think the correct play here is? I feel like the correct play here is actually options. I could totally see an argument for Terra Cloth. However, I feel like the options play for, you know, considering we're going all the way to the chest or the dark room. I don't know which one yet. That's going to pay out a ton with chests. Plus my glitch crown is going to work out in the end. Pestilence. Does anyone feel like this boss is way easier than the regular Pestilence? Like, this champion variant is way easier. I don't know, it feels like I just don't get hit by this guy. I just stick to your regular version, my dude. I feel like you're, uh, you're a better boss when you're yourself, you know what I'm saying? I'm actually gonna go for the world's biggest ganga play and take Magic 8-Ball here on purpose. I feel comfortable in saying that this is early enough and we might get a Planetarium. Planetarium plus Glitched Crown, maybe? Ooh, I don't know, maybe. We'll see, I guess. It was more exciting than any of those other prospects. The most other one that I wanted was probably uh, Cat and Ninetales, but even that was kind of eh. Do I want any of these? An extra life is probably the best thing here. Uh, but I messed up. Huh? Well, that's not the biggest deal. Whatever. Can I open both of these? We get Eden's Blessing. Wire Code Hanger. Well, Eden's Blessing is just straight up better. So I'll take that. We have a Magic Skin available now. Uh, I guess I'll use it one more time on this floor. Our hearts are getting kind of low, though. The Broken Heart Gaming is uh, increasing, and I'm getting a bit worried about it. Not the most, just just a bit. But it's still something I'm concerned about. All right, well, thank you for the Eden's Blessing. So where the hell is the Ultra Secret now? Is it like here? I don't think I got it, guys. That sucks. I thought it would be kind of like uh, by the mob challenge room, but just not the case. Still gonna try one more thing, though. Please spin down this time. Oh! I don't care anymore. Who cares? I I do not give two dams. Give me the rock. This is the only thing that matters in the world currently. Uh, unfortunately, we were unable to land the spin down. I don't think we have any more charges. That's okay. At least I know I worked for it. So I'll just take the bot fly because it is a great item in general and a solemn reminder of the death certificate that never was. But hey, I mean, look at my items. God damn. <laughs> We got ourselves a certified god run. Not to mention a lot of transformation progress. Botfly will contribute to the fungi transformation, as well as magic mushroom going for Beelzebub. And while I'm still not that much of a fan of the Bazinga transformation, Black Lotus contributing to it is definitely appreciated. Am I confusing you yet? <laughs> I feel like there's nothing left to do in life though. Like I, I, on the real, let's get real here. Let's get down and dirty and to the real business. There's no reason to live anymore because magic mushroom is no longer a possibility. What, like what's the motive? Never achieve your dreams, ladies and gentlemen. It's just, it's a terrible scenario. I don't know what to do with myself right now. Look at all these mushrooms and I don't want to blow them up. Who am I? Shot, hello greed. I don't, you're just gonna die. Get stomped on, dumbass. I mean, I guess there is many mushroom to be excited for, but it's just not the same. 
save. You can't tell me that's a save. All right, lots of treasures in this direction, plus a luck up, nice. Treasure room has, okay, well, I mean, I, I don't even know, like, how do I respond to this? This is like the most targeted thing the game's ever done to me. <laughs> this is the only correct option and we all know it. Dice room is a D20 dice, two pip. Uh, I wanted some money uh, just because I forgot what two pip does. <laughs> I should not have picked up those scents, uh, but I don't know, they were just on the ground, they were sitting there, I wanted them, what, what can you do, what can you do? Prop toes, whoa, whoa, god items alert, hello, hold on, give me a moment, sir, it looks like we have to make a decision, would you like piercing or piercing with an extra stat? I'll be taking prop, thank you very much. Boom, another one, there it is. There it absolutely is. There you are. Now this is not exactly, honestly, that good of a combo. It definitely has moments, don't get me wrong, but sometimes you'll encounter a scenario where your pedestals are so good that you'll have two god items on the same pedestal and then you'll only be forced to take, you know, only one of them. But I haven't done a run like this in so long and this is so chill, dude. So I'm, I'm with it, let's just do it. Uh, let's look for the super secret room first before we continue. You. This is like the most blatantly obvious one I've ever seen. Okay, hi. <laughs> uh, nothing in here. That's okay. Let's fight boss. The stain. Better get the oxy clean. <laughs> Now the craziest thing about that joke is I'm not making this lore up. I feel like when I was a kid, I made that joke to myself maybe every single time I fought the stain, ever since he was introduced in Afterbirth. Synthoia for some damage and range as well as spun in here. Oh my god, we're taking the stairway. I'm sorry guys. Holy Mantle's sick, but it's not stairway. Oh my goodness, what could be in here? I will take the wafer. Yeah, yeah, definitely the wafer. Wafer has extra giga value as well. Because of my broken hearts, uh, you can always think of Wafer as kind of doubling the amount of HP that you have. So when you double the amount of HP that you have, uh, when your HP is currently getting lower and lower, like your maximum, it's invaluable at that point. All right, I'm gonna say it. I know everyone's thinking it deep down, maybe subconsciously and not actually actively thinking it, but you're thinking it or you have thought it. I know for a fact. Is this the same room? The vibe, the energy is off and I believe I know why. Wasn't there like a new FNAF game that came out and Markiplier still hasn't done like a let's play on it? What the hell? What's going on, man? <laughs> I think he's like not where he usually is currently. Like he's not at home. I'm not too sure. I actually have not heard a lot about the new FNAF game. I'm trying to not like look or spoil myself. I have not seen it and I think it's been out for a couple days now. Only because, I don't know, my loyalty. <laughs> I feel loyal, okay? I don't know. I mean, I'll watch everyone else, but I gotta watch Mark first. You know, it's just, that's just culture. You know what I'm saying? I'm sure I'll get around to it. In the meantime, treasure room. Oh my god. Uh, Tech Zero is honestly sick, but I feel like it wouldn't do that much for me because of my prop. Uh, that don't mean I ain't gonna take it though. Hey, I had you worried for a second. <laughs> Ooh, hello. Do I pop another magic skin? I think I do. So sick. Ooh, these are actually really good. More deal chance, more stats. Or rune bag. I think rune. Rune bag because if it pays out with even literally one per throw or soul of Isaac the entire run, it's done more than whatever any of those items could have done, even like combined, to be honest with you. Because one per throw turns into five secret room items. And that just can't be understated. Let's go spend some of this cash. Restock. Oh, I'm gonna spend all my money, actually. Let's get that champion's belt. Another one, Pandora or jumper cables. I'm actually gonna take restock here as the smartest play I've ever made. And then check this out. I'm gonna buy Diplo and then perfectly time my balls. Oh yeah, balls achieved. Then we can take you, and then we can take school bag, which means that I can carry an active while not worried about magic skin. Take balls right now, then I'll take the member card, but pay for it with balls, increasing my stats. Order of operations, baby. That's right, dude. Okay, nice. Uh, of all of these, I don't actually really care. I guess I'll take like the voodoo head. <laughs> I want to see what's down here first, because I have restock. This could be large. Birthright for like only eight cents. 100% taking- what the hell, there's a mutant spider. I'm taking you too! <laughs> nice, mutant spider, another one. These are all insane, but the price is constantly going up. So I don't know if I want to do this anymore. <laughs> Wait, my luck is insane. I need tough love, actually. It's also really cheap, so I'll do it. Just a little concerned because, okay, there is a quality four there, uh, but it's all right. I was a little concerned because I have sacred orb, so that's why the items are so good. I think we're okay, though. If I get money, I'd like to save you from the cell that they put you in, man. I'm sorry about that. Ha, but, you know, at the same time, I spent all my money on some items because, yeah, that's the grind set, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> all right, I take it. Come on, come with me, man. 
I also realized that I've had rock bottom for a while, but I uh, just didn't, I, I don't know. Just having rock bottom was enough for my brain to like be like satisfied. I haven't done a single rock bottom thing in maybe <laughs> like the last time. I don't remember the last time I did a rock bottom thing. Did I use a devil card to increase my stats whatsoever? Does it even matter? I'll take the growth hormones almost spun. Uh, this kind of sucks. I all don't even want to take any of these. Should I magic skin this area? Nah, I don't need that just yet. We'll just, we'll just go. Thank you, though. I'm on a quest to get every item ever. I don't want to go in that stairway. I am far too broke. No thanks. I can get a ton of money in time, but just not right now. So sorry and whatnot, but I spent all my money uh, saving my friend from a basement in a shop. I don't want to go into the details. I don't even know how he got there. Hey, how about I use world card and see just what we're working with? That way I can go straight to the treasure room. Not waste any time. See what's in here. Here we go. Oh! Oh, yes, dude. Nice. I now got glasses. You guys wear glasses? I, 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 uh, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to be. <laughs> Uh, my mom tells me about a story where when I was a kid and I was like three years old, I put my face up to the TV uh, while watching it because I guess, I don't know, something in my brain was genetically like, I'm gamer, I need to consume technology right now. The signs were already clear from the beginning. <laughs> uh, ooh, oh my god, wait a second, I'll take the sci-fly here. And apparently after I did that, uh, I was taken to the optometrist and I started having like lazy eye or like cross eyes. And then I had to start wearing glasses. I believe the last time I had like a prescription, my left eye was like 19 and my right eye is 20. So basically like fixed. And then I thought, okay, well, it's basically fixed. I don't need to wear glasses anymore and I haven't worn glasses since, but I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to be uh, doing that thing. Whoopsies. During all that though, exciting news. We found a judgment, which I'd love to pay out. It's gonna kind of suck for our whole money situation, but secret room rolls above all. We've definitely burned a lot of the pool. So this is where it gets kind of good, especially with sacred orb. It's condensed even further. I'm trying- dude, pay out, man. What is wrong with you, bro? Ooh, there's the good stuff. I think the uh, pick is very obvious here due to school bag. And as we make our way to the boss and the shop, I probably won't spend that much money on this next shop. Famous last words, by the way. Luck up. Nice. Uh, just because I want a full-on safer stairway at this point. No matter what you sell me, I wouldn't want it. That's, I mean, that's pretty good, though. I mean, seven cents, that's a good deal, you know what I'm saying? Damn, bargain bin? What they got in the back? Oh, God, dude. I'm two cents short. No way. Maybe this is actually a sign that I should just chill and not buy it. Oh, my God. Come on. Don't do this to me. It's backstabber. It's backstabber. I want backstabber. No, 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 no. I don't need backstabber. What the hell do I need backstabber for? So, I think I'm going to sleep and hope somehow, by miracle, by the time I get to womb one. Oh, my God. I just somehow managed to get enough money. This uh, reverse hanged man might just be it. <laughs> uh, all right, never mind. Everything's good. Don't worry. Negative. Looks like we are going down today. Angel, hello. Oh my god. We're actually super lucky here because there's only one really good quality four item here. So I didn't really have to feel like I was picking. I feel like I'm still a reverse hanged man as well. So maybe I can get some money from this. Nice. <laughs> it's a little, a little lackluster, but yeah, you know, it was, it was money. Thank you. Let's go. Oh lord, this is probably the stupidest thing I ever did. Oh no, it wasn't. It's the smartest. We are a bit short, so I won't be able to take Trisagion or Revelation, but Godhead's right there. It's on sale for some reason. I'm so lucky. Definitely give me you. I'm gonna fight again just because. Maybe a room clear reward. Chest. Oh, three cents? No way. Ah, oh, that would have been sick. Yeah, I'm a bit short. Uh, uh, we expected this to happen, but what if I do this and I somehow get money? He uh, no. No, definitely not. Pascal Candle with uh, Rock Bottom, though. I just remembered Rock Bottom was a thing again, so that's good. Okay, bye, Trisagion. So this is where we're gonna get all our tier rate. Our tier rate that we feel like we've been missing. Rock Bottom, Pascal Candle is coming in clutch. I think we could just take care of Mama Gertie. My god. <laughs> now that he's spin down into anything too good, I don't believe. So a flat damage up will do enough for me. Because I'm sure I'll find odd tears up somewhere. I'm, I'm not worried about that. Uh, and I could explore, but I actually feel confident in just leaving. How many quality fours are we at this time? I feel like we're getting pretty high up there. Oh no! Oh, it's the worst thing that ever happened to me in my life. No, you can't give me golden bombs. Give me golden, like, coins. No, please, like, have the weirdest dime ever. Ah, oh, you're just, you're a prankster. I know it. Okay, but here's the thing. It's not impossible for me to still get Sacred Heart. I don't think. Maybe. Oh, God. Maybe I spin down for fun. Oh, it might be over. 
<laughs> Are you kidding me? It turned into a toothpick. Uh, I don't have a use for it though. Okay, well, let's see. What do we have in store today? A one second kill? A two second kill? Ooh, 0 0.5. Feeling a little spicy today, are you, Isaac? Hello, Angel. Oh. Well, we've definitely confirmed that uh, the whole Sacred Heart deal is over. However, look at that. Crooked's head doesn't do anything. I got Magic Mushroom, but you don't need to think about that. Let me open all of these. Wow, wow, wow. What a chest. Hello? <laughs> Choco milk, dad's ring as well. Woo. I think, unironically, the best pick for that middle pedestal is actually homing. That way I can say like, haha, I got homing from the angel pool. That's because I, uh, you know, I got sacred heart. That wouldn't even work. I have godhead. I already have homing. <laughs> I'm just on a massive cope because somehow this one angel room actually got me the 60 cents in a miraculous manner. But the other one, nah, you don't get to have that. Oh well, I'm taking cricket. And then for some spice, let's add some choco milk and just, you know, spam because this is uh, really broken. Don't matter if your tears don't do a lot of damage and you shoot them fast if you have literal godhead aura. Let's go. Okay, hello, Ludo D8. Uh, how about I pay out and then roll? I guess I could have rolled on the last one as well, but either way. Uh, more damage, wow. Dumperton, money equals power. I think we take damage. Just go full on with the damage at this point. Even more, even more damage. This is all uh, rock bottomed as well. Deadeye actually has one of the best multipliers for rock bottom. Never, ever, ever. As you can see, <laughs> never, ever, ever pass up uh, Deadeye and rock bottom because that is how you truly increase your damage. It's one of the few multipliers when people are farming for damage. I feel like I forget about. These are tap shots as well. Like I'm not even fully shooting, so I'm not getting my maximum Whoa, multiplier. I just did like a Dragon Ball Z move. I flashed and then everything died. Look at that. Oh my God. <laughs> I, I, I'm doing like the end. Oh my God. How am am I doing this? I walk in a room and I do like the anime flash <laughs> and then everything dies. This is awesome. That is so, uh, that is an awesome synergy. Sometimes it doesn't work if I don't hit the contact damage, but whatever. All right, what do you got cooking in here, Satan? Gumbo? Stew? I don't think this man's cooking anything, guys. Get out of here. Get Dragon Ball Z flashed. Anime engage, you are already dead. Boom. <laughs> I can't believe what kind of absurdo synergy I found. Okay. Nice, we're here. Stairway! Jacob's Ladder is great, Parissa Toy is great. But also they're like, ah, eh, you know, they're, they're good. But, oh, well, I didn't want to take that, but hi, Ghost Pepper. I don't know. I mean, Jacob's Ladder is good. I'm not going to disrespect that. I will miss it, though, like 100%. Reroll? Uh, I don't care about these either. Let's see blood then, thank you. Check, 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 and check. I already see some bangers. I see a twisted pear. I see a Haymo, oh my God. Here's the worrisome part. If I take Haymo and twisted, I'll be one HP. But that's also like what would make this legendary. Half the rooms on this entire floor alone are just like brimstone flies that kill you out of nowhere because you didn't see how fast you killed everything else. Uh, I'll take some Scorpio for fun. At this point, I'll take Haymo when I have at least two HP. Thank you. I, uh, I definitely gotta find at least one more soul heart. No magic skin uses just yet. I need... Hello! Oh! Oh my god, I didn't even see it. Oh my god, this poly. I just registered that at the very end. I can't believe it. Like, I was looking at the chest slowly, and I was thinking, Oh, Cricket's body, that's pretty good. I'll just go back there and, uh, and take it. But as I was leaving, that poly showed up for one frame. That was, like, uh, a visceral reaction from me. That felt insane. What an absurd run. What the hell? Triple shot. Most definitely, yes. Okay, it's just getting worse. It's getting more and more. Parasite. Is that another Polly? Uh, did I breakfast? No way. I can't believe it. I think I did. I mean, why else would breakfast be showing up? Hello? But seriously? Wow. I, wow. Wow. As it stands, it's just probably as good as it's gonna get. So I guess we just went through every item ever. Well then let's uh, cap off this insane run by doing the thing that you're supposed to do with rock bottom. Which is have the perfect scenario to where you have soy milk as your very last item. Uh, and then also Dr. Fetus because why the hell not? And now we're shooting whatever this is. I would hate to be the bottom right corner right now. Did I just summon like the horde? What? That was so cool. Hold on. I need to. I need to one more time. I barely shoot at all. And I, I just like, I become a civilization. Look at me. Oh my, this is the coolest thing ever. I need to take this to the Mega Satan fight immediately. I like this like ghost armada thing. Here's what I want to do. I want to shoot in a direction where there are going to be no enemies. But I want to see, there you go. I want to see all the ghosts kill everything. Look at them go. They do so much damage. Oh my God. This is sick. What? I have never seen a synergy like this. 
I'm, I'm shooting a lot more. Let's get them all ready. Here we go. Get them all ready for Mega Satan 2. Let's see how fast we can clear them. All right, here we go. Go get them, lads. Oh my God, they're going. It's over. <laughs> Whoa, look at the, look at the, oh, look, it's all black. I did that much explosions. What did the run become? <laughs> What's GG? If you're wondering what I got, by the way, I'm trash. <laughs>